Look, I'm feeling very excited at the moment and uh, thinking of the players a lot because, you know, having been there, done that, um, it's a very, very exciting time for the team and I'm only hoping that uh, they're lucky enough to experience what we were lucky enough to do. To play in a Premiership in the first year as an 18-year-old, so I'm thinking of young Bowie at the moment because he's in the same boat and then uh, I was lucky enough then to play in the Premiership in year two in 1960 and again then in 64. We were raging hot favourites in 1964. We had beaten Collingwood, our old uh, rivals, uh, by something like 89 points in the second semi-final. And in those days you went straight from the second semi-final into the grand final. So having beaten Collingwood so convincingly in the second semi-final, as it turned out, uh, we won by four points and probably lucky in one way to do that. When you play in a premiership, you, you f create a bond that is basically lifetime. Uh, you do something, you achieve something special, you achieve something that few people have the, um, are lucky enough to do. You relive that over and over again. Oh, look, there's, no doubt there's, a, there's a, a feeling of, of pride within the Melbourne supporters that I'm speaking to. Uh, and even a lot of people that are not Melbourne supporters. I mean, they're getting on the bandwagon and um, I'm just hopeful that the boys can uh, do the supporters proud, and I'm sure they will. My first grand final, sitting there doing my boots up and the coach coming to me, put the, put the hand on the shoulder and said, son, you may never, ever play in another grand final and he put the hand on the other shoulder and he said, son, good sides don't lose grand finals. And that has sort of has rung clear. It's, um, I've thought of that so many times in the last couple of weeks, that these guys are going to play the game of their life and uh, they may never get the opportunity again. Only hope, hope that they are lucky enough to experience what, what I have experienced.